How to control the LEGO power functions servo motor. In the following I will use the servo motor of the company Bluebricks. This will be important for the later part of this video, where I will compare this servo motor with the LEGO Technic one. If you connect your servo motor with the battery box, the servo motor will rotate to the left or right position depending on the direction you select on your battery box. Your servo motor with a 9 volt of the battery box, nothing will happen. As soon as you use the control lines C1 and C2, the servo motor will rotate to the left or to the right depending on the polarity between C1 and C2. Note that you have to apply 9 volt additionally. I control the position of the servo motor using pulse width modulation, either to the left or to the right side. What you can observe is that this blue brick servo motor will rapidly change to the left or the right position. There is no gradual steering of the servo motor observable. If you look at the documentation of the LEGO servo motor 88004, you see that there are 15 different positions of the servo motor available. In this video you can see that indeed different positions are controllable with the pulse width modulation. You can see the duty cycle of the pulse width modulation in the analog oscilloscope.